I was heading to stables. Donut. Oh. Hello, wolf. You know, fun fact. I, uh... I used to have a wolf companion of my own, but, uh, apparently he doesn't work in this game. He just gives me a lot of meat. Oh, and a shrine behind the stable. That's another hut container or stamina. Yep. I had to. That wolf didn't see what was coming. He... He never saw it coming. To be fair, I don't think a lot of wolves expect someone to fall out of the sky with a hammer comprised of a claymore and a giant rock. Arrow? Goron City. Well, that's not the usual path up to Goron City. Strange. The usual path was via Akala. You, performers. Should we tell the newspaper what happened here? Absolutely! We'll tell this whole awful story to the Lucky Clover Gazette and no one else. They'll take it seriously. I don't know how we'll get word of this to them, though. The Lucky Clover Gazette is in Hebrew, working out of a stable over there. What, what situation are you talking about? Th You're clearly the band that I'm looking for, but you're missing your flutist that I know exists because a great fairy mentioned it. Speaking of great fairies. Uh, anyway. Where was I? Kilton? Hello? And I'll jump in a well. Well, well, well. What's all this then? Yes, we did see a Goron walking past. But we'll see more Gorons when we actually get to the city. What was the point of this? Is this a healing hot spring, or...? To break some rocks just to have access to a small pond with no fish, no fairies, no anything seems a little weird. But you know what? It is just a well. Whoop! I accidentally hit B. And we ascend, but better this time. I did not hit B that time, I was spamming A. Screw you, game. I probably just fat-fingered it. it. Yeah, staying under a tree will keep you dry. Hello, Mr. Goron. You don't like rain. Hmm. Hot springs, there's some near the foothill stable. Thank you. Uh, I'll get my horse out in a sec. Lucky Clover Gazette, what's the news? Great fairies flee into their flower, flower blood. Uh huh. Other stories? Blood Moon brings dangerous nights. Okay. Come to the front desk again, sir. I'd like to take out a horse. 
Woodland Stable, first time here, I get a new pony point. Oh. That's a reward. Yeah, huh? Oh. I would like to take a horse. Bring a pony over here. Uh huh. Death Mountain hot. I know. Receive reward. Give me the thing to hook up a horse to a cart. Towing harness. Lovely. Wagon or an item I'd like to tow somewhere. Okay. Come, Epona. We've got places to go. Specifically, finding out what happened to that band member. Because no one is going to tell us. Hang on. Stable. Uh, stable. Shrine. Even. And then I'll head up to the Great Fairy. Talk to her, see what she says. See if she knows what happened. Hmm. Rise and fall. The Echo Chiu Shrine. Hmm. Press button. Launches block. And recall. We Hmm. Blocks slowly float away, have climbable surface. Let's alter hand this over to me. And I will get on it, then we'll recall it. Do ba do 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 ba do do ba do do. It's not going to rise me into the air, is it? Because there's like a dispenser for it there. Rewind further, please. Please, I beg of you. Okay. I guess I can force it to take me upwards. I'll just have to drop it myself. Ah, Zonite Shield. Um. Drop my Night Shield. Hmm. The single Zonite shield. It's just a basic Zonite shield, it's not worth it. Okay, Ultra Hand. Lift the block up to a surface I can climb from. And then bring it down and over here. And then recall. Up we go. Hang on, there's, there's a button here. The idea is likely to do what we've been doing with recall tricks, but I have another idea. Technically, this is also a recall trick, but different than what I think the game expects. I think it wants me to put the block on here, launch the block, then I'll come over here, climb on it, and recall. But why do that when I can fling myself? Hello. 
Give me your blessing, light, good sir and madam statue. Actually, you could both be female. I, I don't know about that, Zonai. I've kind of just assumed in my head it was Raru. But it could be anyone, theoretically. Though the left arm it has extended has the same patterning. Raru's Zonai arm was on his right hand, so... I don't know. Yep. Any homest to the great fairy. This is also somewhat the direction of the Korok Forest. You know what? I guess we could check to see what's happened to the Deku tree. Why it had disappeared in those trailers. Hello, great fairy. Do you know what happened to the bandmate? You want to hear the violin player? Okay. Easy enough. At least the violin player is still with us. Hopefully the violin player is willing to play without the other bandmates that appear to be missing. You. You have a violin. Play it, please. Uh, I'm going to have to go to the Lucky Clover Gazette, aren't I? I'm going to have to technically work for them in order to, uh, get their attention. If I work for the Lucky Clover Gazette, they'll talk to me. That means going to Hebra, and I don't want to do that yet. Also, uh... Kilton? You okay, friend? You appear to just be staring off absently into the distance. Um, take a picture! Wait. Got it. Hope he's okay. You there, traveler! Do you have business in this cave by chance? By any chance? I'm sorry to say, but right now it's... Big brother! Kilton has a younger brother? That... Seems to be... A fan of Satori stuff. Kilton, Colton, okay. It's no use, Colton. It's impossible, absurd even, to try to turn yourself into a legendary creature, a Satori no less. Absurd. You should be working on the monster collection with me instead of chasing a silly dream like... I'll never give up, Kilton. I've always wanted to be a Satori. I will be a Satori. I do not care what it takes. All I need is to get my fingers on a bubble gem. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, I see. Yeah, I overheard you talking. I have bubble gems. Yep, tell me about your dream. You want to turn into a Satori. You think that... Having a bunch of bubble gems will let you do that. Okay. Uh, here, take this. That's a bubble gem! Real thing, perfect shape, faint glow, it's real. A bacoblin mask. Thanks. Anyway. You... You eat the bubble gem. 
It's done nothing. You need more? You've decided to set on a journey to collect more. Yeah, huh? Next time I have some. Sure. By the way, I have a fair few in my inventory right now if you. And he's gone. Off he goes, hope he's able to make his dream come true. And you'll be on your way too. Okay. Visit Kilton in Tarrytown to find out where Colton is. Great. Anyway. Time to beat the bubble frog he was actually worried about. And I'm so low on arrows though. I'm going to fix this broken cart. Just just because it's here, you know. Oh, that was wrong. What are you doing? Please don't do anything strange like that to our dear Risa. Okay. What if I attach a wheel properly? But but I can fix your cart, sir. Hey, I can fix it. I, I can fix it. What if I slowly nudge it away? What's under the rock? Nothing. Okay. But if I keep dropping things... To slowly nudge the cart away, he might not be concerned about it. Okay, he's still concerned about it. Fine, you want to be like that? I'll fix your cart when you actually want to talk to me. Later. There's the Pona. Good girl. Hey! <laughs> I, I was gonna do the hop on as she moved past, but uh... Apparently, I mistimed it. Oh, hang on, hang on, whoa, whoa girl, steady, steady, we're gonna, we're gonna go talk to that Gerudo that we walked past, T turn around, well, you really don't want to go through there, do you girl, okay, we're just gonna try and turn in place, until we face the other way, there you go, good girl. Now, this Gerudo, we're just gonna walk up to her calmly. Where are you going, ma'am? Are you going to that restaurant at the top of the hill? Or perhaps it isn't food you hunger for. Could it be you have an appetite for me? No. <laughs> Just joking, please, no need to look so petrified. I'm interested in the roast, which I hear is very popular among Gorons lately. They say the flavour breaks your heart, and the texture breaks your teeth. <laughs> ah, good old rock roast. Okay. If there's a restaurant at the top of the hill, I suppose I'll check it out. Though I don't see why the Korok Forest is meant to be up there. Unless by the restaurant at the top of the hill she meant on the way to Death Mountain. 
top of the hill. Hmm. Beautiful. But oh, that's gloom. Uh, Pona, I don't want you stepping in that. Also, hello, friend. Go away. I'll take his parts, though. Having a homing arrow is nice. Even if I don't really use it. Hmm. Now, onwards. Hopefully things don't get too gloomy this way. Ever means. What a ridiculous enemy. Um, well, the forest is uh, definitely a little different than I remember. I got lost just from entering this doorway. Yeah. The Lost Woods, it's not just foggy now, it's black foggy. Well, time to see if a tried and true technique works. This can't be my only potentially flammable weapon. Let's see if it's still a case of if you have a fire, follow the wind. That's not going to ignite if I use that. Okay, if I use this as a torch, ca catch the weapon on fire, not the human, thank you. There we go. It broke instantly. Hmm. Well, I could try and brute force it. Go around to the right. Nope. <laughs> Go around to the left. Nope. Strange. I'll try lighting an arrow. Yeah, it doesn't have embers to really point in a direction. We go up. We go over. No. Hmm. What has happened to these woods? Can't even enter the first room to begin to go around. No. Nope. But here is safe. That's interesting. Oh. This is a bit outside the woods, isn't it? This isn't a way through. And this is the water below. Okay. The answer might be finding an alternative entrance. Because the usual entrance is... Uh... A little too aggressive on the fog. As opposed to what it used to be. Hmm. Oh, and a blood moon is rising too. Isn't that just peachy? What 
Oh, there it is. The blood, the blood. Yep. Maybe my best option is to try and fly over. Just going through really just isn't working right now. Opponent, come on. We've got to find a new way through there. There we go. Didn't have to callop that fast, girl. Come on. Time to try the ancient art of going around. Whoa. That mist has completely domed it over. It'd be hard to tell where the center of the forest is. Maybe the Great Deku Tree is still in there. Because we didn't see this darkness enshrouding it in the uh, trailers. We just saw a missing Deku Tree. But maybe that's just an, as an aesthetic thing. Because now that darkness is there. Hmm. It is possible that you're just not meant to go in until later. But in a game this open, I find it hard to believe. But I'm definitely not meant to go in by flying in. Also, there's a shrine over there. I'm definitely not meant to do what I'm about to try and do anyway. No, I don't have the height from there. But, if one of the nearby islands, the Sky Islands, has a place I can launch a wing from, I can try and drop straight in, and it probably won't work. But that's okay. What's important is that I try. Uh, this isn't the first time I've entered Death Mountain from the wrong direction. But this time it's not for the purpose of trying to enter Death Mountain. It's for the purpose of getting to that forest. Hmm. Still nothing I can recall up. A deer? Up here? That's odd. Oh, hello. That's a new statue. What are you carrying there? Wooden chest? Yeah, it doesn't bother me. There's also that big spiral sky island that I've... Weird dropout, but okay. Considering there was no signs of it dropping out until the screen popped up. But, uh... As I was saying... There is that big spiral sky island over there. What are you doing? The... The controllers are still very clearly connected. Both were lit up. But this appears to be very above. Eh, I guess it's a bit past the forest. I, I thought it might have been more directly above. Hmm. With enough zonite, I can make things that I don't have materials for. I could just try a normal wing. Ah, uh, what do you mean can't take it out here? Come on. Don't be a spoil spot game. There we go. We're just gonna 
nudge this towards the edge so I can well, tip it, tip it off. And if I tip it, it should start flying the moment it's free falling. Never mind. Oh, hey, we have flight. We're heading pretty directly to the center, I think. Might want to give it a bit more height. Oh, come on now. Oh, no, 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 no. Well, the fog does start up here, but it's not captured me yet. A and it had the second I unmapped. Hmm. But that could just be because I was towards the edge and not in the middle. I shouldn't try this a second time. It would clearly be a complete waste of time. But... It keeps dropping pretty directly downwards without a whole lot of forward momentum. That was literally worse than my last attempt. Hmm. Oh well. It's a lost cause. I should probably head back toward the uh, tower that I was going to go to before we actually head in towards uh, the Gorons.